Hi Taurus, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Let's start first. Let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's start with the current situation. What are the current energies? You think this person was a bit immature in love? There is some truth here that may have been revealed. Your main priority right now may be finding a more stable uh, connection or you give another chance to this past situation only if you were convinced they are more mature and they want something long term. Also, at your focus is your career and business as well. But let's see more details why the King of Pentacles. You want some communication to happen even though you may have this feeling like it has ended uh, and it cannot be restored. You fear conflicts may arise but you want to know for sure now by meeting them and talking to them if they have grown up in love and uh, is it worth repeating that connection with them. Now what is affecting you in your subconscious? The dramas of the past, the connection being with many ups and downs and very volatile, flamey and uh, not stable at all. What happened in the past? What was, uh, what was the challenge or the challenges? There was love there, definitely. Uh, and I'm getting two stories here. First, it's for sure the love was not mutual or it was not shared the same way. Somebody loved more than the other. Now the two stories I'm getting is either there were plans about getting married or moving to the next step or you were already married and had a family together. But there was lots of indecision from one partner and also being cold, detached, harsh with the words, the communication may have not been good at all and uh, being cold and detached. So it was not harmonious and the love was not mutual. So that's what I'm getting as the main challenges. And it feels like in the past what happened, it just closed that book. And uh, that was a closed cycle. Now, how do you view the situation with them? You still feel attraction. That's why you keep waiting and hoping for progress. But let's see more details. Your fear is that the situation will keep moving with this pace, moving slowly. That is your fear. Yes, you want stability, but you don't want it. That little progress. And your focus is to be in a, in a real passionate connection. I'm getting that you still want to hope that they haven't lost attraction for you, that they still want to be with you. But let's see, what are their energies towards you right now? Yes, they do have attraction for you. Even though they feel distant emotionally, they want to heal the situation. Now, are they optimistic? It will happen fast or it is easy to repair and heal the situation? No. They feel pessimistic about this. They have attraction. They have been waiting, but they have lost optimism because the progress has not been uh, that much or none at all. And they see this uh, situation being quite uh, in a bad position, like feeling like uh, it has been destroyed, like you both may have felt alone with each other, 
especially the later parts of the connection. They have been waiting for a restart. First they wanted silence. There may have been silence treatment. So after the breakup they uh, may have uh, stopped talking to you. In fact they were recovering. Then after some time they they got missing you. So they really missed you and they started to to hope that there are chances again about a restart. But they were doing just that, I think. Waiting, being passive. So they their hope is to heal this uh, situation, this connection with you. They still do have lots of attraction. Uh, I have the Queen of Wands there. But for the structure of the relationship, its framework seems very fragile and delicate and it's like it cannot be easily put back into place and be solid. Now I want to continue this reading with more details about them. What kind of feelings do they have towards you right now? How do they view you at this moment from the outside? What are their intentions? What are the energies? If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. Or if you are watching this from your mobile phone, you can just click the title, the description box will expand and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching, see you in the next reading and bye for now.